Hello, YouTubers. Now, Paul just got home here on uh, Thursday the 15th. Thursday the 15th, there uh, in 2014, here around uh, 16:30 in the afternoon Eastern Daylight Time. Now, he's he's got he's got some more waterfowl accounts to uh, relate. Um, some involving a goose, apparently. All right, we had. A pair of geese, they made a nest outside the pool window. And this is their second time back there. Last year, no chicks. They got tired, they walked off. This year, one chick hatched. Well, they spent most of the day still around with the nest. The mother kept taking the new chick. And walking around with it, teaching, getting it to drink water and eat grass and stuff. And the dad would lay it on the nest. Well, then she'd come back with the new chick, and he'd get off, and she'd lie down with the new chick under her on the nest, and she'd lay there for a while. Well, then she'd get up, and the new chick would run over into the grass and go eating. Would she stand there and squawk and scream at the other three eggs that had not hatched? Oh, shit, so they, okay. So, it turned out, well then, they did this all day, Monday. Well, they finally left. Nothing was going on. Well, Tuesday morning... You mean the, the, the mother and the dad and the other... And the one chick. Really? And abandoned the three eggs? They left the last three eggs. Oh, I'll be darned. Because nothing else happened all Monday. Oh, okay. So Let's they see. left late Monday afternoon, just why I left for work, for, to come home. So, some reason, a housekeeper and her husband went around Tuesday afternoon to look at the eggs for some reason. Well, there happened to be one of them was trying to hatch. So they took that egg and they took it home. And they finished helping that chick hatch out of that egg. And they <laughs> cleaned it up and everything. <laughs> got it all cleaned up. Got the crap off of it, whatever's on it when it comes out of the egg. Bong. Mung, no. mung is on the, mung is on, on, on. <laughs> So anyway, they brought it back today. <sighs> so I'm not for sure what day they got it because I had Tuesday and Wednesday off. I don't know, not for sure what day they, they took that egg. But they did take the egg home and they helped that chick hatch. So they brought the chick back today. And the MG was even picking it up and playing with it, holding it in that day. And Manny was going to keep the chick in by on the, one of the folding tables and take care of it during the day. Because when they got off work, then they were going to go and try to see if they could find the parents and give it back. That that. That chick's imprinted on them. That chick ain't gonna leave them. Well, supervisor of the cleaning, she started yelling at him, saying that the goose had to go somewhere. It could not stay in the, there. So he called and told his wife. She came down, picked it up. She took it up, she put it in a supply room on the sixth floor and kept it with her all day while she was working on the sixth floor. And every time this chick hears her voice, it starts chirping and squawking. No, oh, of course. I mean, the, the, the creatures imprinted on them. I mean, since they were the first ones that... Uh, it saw. Yeah, saw and heard while well, uh, it had been hearing its mother... Uh, but presumably that 
Presumably it's presumably that one's it's kissed off its it's kissed off its mother apparently, huh? Yeah. Well, now it thinks a Spanish woman is its mother. Well, you could have worse 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 people to be your mother than a Spanish woman. No. <laughs> anyway, they think they might be able they're thinking they could find the mother and father and uh, I don't think it's I don't think it's gonna work. I think it's gonna be like those that PBS thing where the where the the geese flew alongside this guy in the ultralight, you know? Yeah. Yeah. They taught him how to fly. They taught yeah, him Yeah. I it's gonna be Well maybe do Well the, maybe you could the maybe they could thing. teach the this 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 goose to, you know, help with the house cleaning up there in the hotel. Well, they're gonna, <laughs> like you said, they're going to have to, like, try and teach it how to go and eat grass and scrubs instead of bread. Well, I, I think that, that goose is going to spend, be spending a lot of time in their backyard. Assuming they have a backyard, maybe they don't have a backyard. Well... They live in an apartment complex. Well, in that apartment, that goose goes a lot of time in their apartment. In their bathtub. <laughs> All right. Yeah, well, somebody's got to teach it to swim somewhere. Anything, anything else, Paul? Yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> All right.